Nigeria's Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, Sir Heineken Lokobiri, has uh, announced that the Cardinal Refinery will be rehabilitated by the end of 2024. The 110,000 uh, barrels per day capacity refinery is one of Nigeria's four dysfunctional refineries producing no petrol for years and relying heavily on imported petroleum products. In February 2023, the Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited, NNPCL, signed an agreement with Korean company, Daewoo Engineering and Construction Nigeria Limited, for the rehabilitation project. Now, the minister visited the refinery to assess the ongoing rehabilitation work and expressed optimism that the refinery will return to life by the end of 2024. The uh, refinery is meant to come from what um, the brief that we got is meant to be. Uh, completed by the end of 2024, but what uh, the GCO said, uh, everything that uh, is required to ensure that, you know, within uh, the work schedule, everything goes on smoothly from what we hear from the GCO is put in place, and uh, me as Minister, my only to hold them accountable, you know, to what they have said, and I'll continue to hold them accountable, continue to um, support them, work with them to ensure that we deliver to Nigerians at the refineries, which are very, very important uh, uh, for the survival of our economy. Our plans are in progress. We will deliver this plant by the end of 2024. Every requirement to do this is in place, including process for delivery of peace stock at the end of the at the end of that de deadline. And our contractor have mobilized to size substantially. We have started receiving all necessary equipment that is required for this quick fix activity. And we are very confident that we will have the appropriate financing to get this to the end of it. And ultimately, the Kaduna Refinery will restart again and it will deliver value to Nigerians. And I'm assuring the Honorable Minister that this will be delivered just as we're also doing for the other refineries. We do uh, our plan the quick fix for 60 percent of capacity so that we can start making money from this plant and then we'll continue the rest of the process so that we can bring it to full name plate capacity which will also tally with the completion of the BOT on the pipeline so that you have a reliable pipeline delivery infrastructure. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.